We're the National Community Pharmacists Association, and we're basically an organization that encompasses uh, everything in community pharmacy, as well as a, a certain um, cer certain central focus on independent pharmacy. I've heard a lot. I heard a lot of good things about NCPA, and you know, I just had to see it for myself firsthand. So I went to the meetings, and I was just like, "Wow!" You know, I actually get a lot out of these meetings. There's a different uh, niche that each meeting is kind of focused on. For instance, we have, um, like I said, uh, we have three or four different speakers that'll come and speak uh, on legislation. That's, I feel like that's a very important thing because laws that are, laws that are passed today and instilled tomorrow can affect us literally tomorrow. Most of our service opportunities will be dealing with uh, independent, local independent owners that will let us go to their pharmacy and promote health awareness issues like blood pressure and uh, you know just kind of just kind of red flags in certain chronic disease states. There's five different scholarships, and you can apply for essentially each one of them, but you can only get one of the five. And once you get, uh, if you are awarded one of the scholarships, you can't, excuse me, you can't apply for that scholarship again in the future, but you can apply for the other one. So, um, so that's good. And they amount from anywhere from $2,000 to $2,500 a year. There are internship opportunities available. Um, I believe the internship is in is located at the national headquarters in uh, Alexandria, Virginia. It's it's a ten week opportunity um, internship, and uh, you basically be kind of learning. It would be more of a learning process of um, how an association runs its everyday activities. We, there's an annual convention. Um, it's usually held around mid-October. A lot of them are held on the East Coast. Um, but th this year, the, the convention was held at San Diego. We even have a, uh, a student business plan competition that is held every year. We have our business plan committee. And uh, each year we work on this business plan to submit to NCBA National. And uh, it's, it's pretty much a year-round process that we work on this plan. We actually made the top 10 last year for the, uh, na for the national team, and I uh, got to present that at convention last year. They promote professional growth. They promote leadership qualities in students and make it known that you need to fight for your profession. You know, whether it's at the or just writing a letter to your senator um, or state representative. Uh, and the third thing is, and probably most importantly, would be uh, we're very much you know, in collaboration with the other organizations. We very much promote the, the pharmacy profession as a whole. If you are interested in independent pharmacy at all, or um, as I mentioned earlier, just anything to do with independent pharmacy, working in a small business and just having, wanting to learn more about that approach, um, that we are definitely the organization that you want to look into.